Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Man Manga Boy The Box Unboxer. Uh, today we have the beginning of June. I mean July. I've got my cat right next to me. I would show her to you, but she's extremely camera shy. To start off, we have Act Age Volume 1. Again, authors are pedophile. These books are coming out of print because of that. Um, and they're not continuing. There's only two volumes that came out to America. And they also stopped it in Japan. But it's supposed to be a really good story. I probably won't ever read it. I think I pretty much just have it for a collector's item. Because I kind of want to get all the Shonen Jump volumes <laughs> since I'm pretty close. Um, but otherwise, probably not worth it to read it, to be honest. Um, but I got it at like 12 bucks. I just know it's going to skyrocket because that's the climate we live in these days as manga collectors. <laughs> uh, this is a box from Right Stuff. Oh, look at that. It's like, the, it's like a little burrito. I've missed these Right Stuff packages, these little burritos. Let me unravel it. Unravel my Ritos. Oh, and look at this. A few gems here. So this is going to be the... Um, everything I needed for 7th Garden right here. Volume 5. Looks pretty cool. Nice and blue. Purpley blue. And I'm pretty sure this is the same author who does Magus of the Library. This manga was recommended to me by a commenter, so I figured I would check it. Oh! Um... <clears throat> I'll give it a read pretty soon as well. Uh, and Seraph of the End, Volume 21. I think this is the most up-to-date volume of Seraph of the End. Um, <clears throat> not 100% though. But Seraph of the End, I'm missing like a few volumes. Like, I think it's 10 through 13 or 11 through 13. Can't quite remember the exact gap. Twin Star Exorcist, I'm, I think it's only Volume 15 I'm missing. And then I have them all. So that's pretty good. Twin Star Exorcist is about these two people who are destined to have intercourse and make the child will save the world. Oh, oh, oh. Youthful romance. Don't you love it? Gotta love it. If you don't love it, you hate the world because it's gonna die. That's just the way it is. My cat left, by the way. She got too shy. It's just the way it is, you know? Cats, what can you do? <clears throat> All right, let's get all this stuff out of the way. Ooh, look at this. Does anybody need this? This stuff here? I don't think so. But uh, help yourself. I don't know what this is for. <laughs> um, yeah, the the holiday sales or birthday sales are pretty much over now. But thank you, thank you, right stuff. I'm sure when you meant to send it uh, forever ago. We were probably still having a birthday sale. Probably were. <laughs> oh well, that's fine. Whatever. Let me just unwrap all of this malarkey here. Spin it around town. Is there for real only one book in this? <laughs> so you have one book in this box. Right stuff decided to send me one book. Volume 6 of Yona and the Dawn. And I, I can't even read it because I'm I'm missing most of the volumes before this. <laughs> uh, thank you, Right Stuff. Uh, this this was the one I was waiting for. I'm so glad you uh, fast-tracked it, as they say. <laughs> Let's hop over to the next Right Stuff box. Get out my trusty knife cutter here. Oh, you guys see that clean cut? Ooh, my, my. Somebody get a camera ready. That was like, oh, perfect. So you can see here we have a, quite a bit of goodies um, in this box here. World Peace. This is by, uh, I think it's somebody in America, actually, through the uh, Viz Media's new thing. They're calling them Viz Originals, where we submit works, I suppose. Uh, and it's it's read like the you know traditional English way. I got it because I uh, gotta support the American people, but um, I'll be honest, I did not expect it to, to read the Mr. Orientation. I saw the screenshots and, uh, you know, I, I just didn't think about it. 
Dora Hidoro, Volume One. Finally, I can I can actually read Dora Hidoro, even if it is just one volume. But uh, it's a start. You got to start somewhere, and and now that I have started at Volume One, uh, I could start. But uh, you know, I won't. <laughs> I won't start. <laughs> Not until I get more. Uh, Ikigami, The Ultimate Limit, Volume Seven. I think I'm only missing volume three. Oh wait, this is three, isn't it? Yep. Here we go. If you got me the ultimate limit of oh, volume two. I think that's all I needed. I think that was it. Doro Hidoro, volume 13. Look at that. Very cool cover. I love all the Doro Hidoro covers. Volume 16. Looking cool, looking lit, like a little devil on there. Uh, you know, the author of Doro Hidoro has a... Ooh, this is a really cool cover. I like the green contrast with the blue. Is currently releasing a manga called Die Dark. Um, Doro Hidoro has finished. Um, <clears throat> but I'm just trying to collect all of the volumes like during the sales that I can. I'm pretty sure I bought them all during a Viz Media sale. There's a lightning thunderstorm outside right now. I don't know if it picked it up on the camera and the microphone. It looks like it did. Kind of neat. Volume 3 of the Death Note <laughs> All in Black Edition. Um, all the pages are black and I think it looks so neat. This is going to be Volume 2. Not 11. This is the Roman numeral version. Okay, guys? And again, these look really cool. The inside, obviously, the pages aren't black. So... You know, if there's a flashback, you're going to have a hard time figuring out uh, from looking at the outside. You're going to have to read it. Um, and then the only one I'm missing is, is volume 5. Um, this is 4. There's only 6. These are just 2 in ones So they're the fanciest 2 in ones around, though. So don't you forget it. My son, Ikoko. I don't know. My son, I Ikoko. I, I don't know. <laughs> How to say it, but this is by Rumiko Takahashi. I don't know too much about this work other than it's Rumiko Takahashi, so I buy it. Just the way of the world. <clears throat> um, but yeah, I'm pretty interested in it. I like the color pages. I don't I don't actually want to know much more about it. I kind of like to just be surprised, you know, just to kind of know where it goes. Or see where it goes, not know where it goes. Uh, Ch Children of the Whales, volume 17. This is like the only volume I have of this. Don't even begin to ask me why I have volume 17 and I don't even think I bought 1 through 16 yet <laughs> but it, it's the path I chose <laughs> a blue flag volume 1 pretty sure I'm missing 2 and 3 and that's it but um, that's pretty cool this recently wrapped up in English they, they released the last one which is volume 8 I heard good things about it, so I decided to pick it up. I didn't hear much about the ending, which is usually a bad sign, but that's okay. Um, Twin Star Exorcist, Volume 11, it looks like. And, um, yeah, this is what I meant. After these, then I'm only missing 15. Volume 16. And then Volume 22. I'm pretty sure that they announced the end of this is either coming or has already came in Japan, I'm not sure. Um, but it is going to be wrapping up soon. Moriarty the Patriot, Volume 4. I have Volume 3. I just don't have Volume 2 yet. I did order it through Right Stuff. Uh, I'm just like, you know, wondering where it is. Donde esta la biblioteca, as they say. <laughs> Seventh Garden, Volume 3. That's the last one I needed. Ooh, that's a nice freaking yellow. It's very highlightery. Cool. Very neat. And volume 10 of Fushigi Yugi, uh, the prequel. I think I'm missing volume 2 or 3 of this, and then I have all of them. Uh, I got this for my girlfriend because she liked the covers of the main one, um, <clears throat> the main series. And so I got her the whole thing too. She really <laughs> likes the prequel, and she thinks that the two in ones are only okay. I don't like, thanks great for that <laughs> uh, anyways thank you for watching today's haul uh, more stuff for July on the way July is gonna be a sweet month let me know what you thought of this video please like comment subscribe and we'll see you on the next one bye bye